Right, cracked it. For those of you that want to hit it a bit further and thinking I haven't got any gun spin anymore, this is your baby. IE09. Tungsten weight on the bottom, pulls the weight CG down, puts loads of mass behind the contact, like I said earlier on the cutaways. The face on this is marriaging steel, so it's really, really tough and fast, but it's only 2.7mm thick. That's nothing, right? So that's giving you that unbelievable amount of ball speed. Okay, it's a graphite shaft in there, it comes in steel as well, but the face is so fast. So it's easy to hit, gets it up in the air, doesn't spin. So it's almost going along this sort of fast fairway wood type scenario where you've got you know high ball speed low spin and high launch so once you've got that going on it's going to go further right so what i'm going to do i'm going to do a little test i've got my ping g25s against this 7-9 so 7-9 against 7-9 okay still against graphite and we'll see what wins no brainer by the way this is going to smash it okay so Here's the numbers from the 7-iron test, so you can see how much speed's created out of that graphite shaft, so that does go quicker. Smash factors are identical, swing-wise pretty much similar again, but the ball speed's jumped by 6 miles an hour, launch angle's lower, spin's less. Yes, the Onyx is a, is a degree or so stronger than the uh, G25, but it's 14 yards further. So if you need, that's in carry by the way, so if you want a little bit more gun speed out of what you've got, then that iron is, is ideal for you. Dispersionally as well, you can see the two. My pings are pretty good actually, I like my G25s. And you can see, okay, it's a little bit hot and cold. That's where graphite starts to move around a little bit. It dispersionally starts to spray where the, the steel shafted pings are a lot tighter. But the actual way they come off the, the thing just felt so fast. So you can see now what we're talking about in terms of that initial speed of the face and the spin and the launch angle. So. For those of you who struggle for distance who want an iron to get up in the air or get going, I should say, that could be a choice for you at that premium end of the market.